Hey guys, welcome back to Tomodachi Life. Last time we added in my main man, Chuckles the Enchilada, my favorite character. But the problem was, today I had like a really long day at work, so I didn't have the chance to actually record in the morning when the Mies would actually be awake, because like I said earlier in the series, this game runs off a real-time clock, so due to that fact, Mies aren't going to be awake when it's nighttime, so sadly I wasn't able to record anything in the morning, which means I need to record something after work. So currently it's after work, and I'm tired as hell. So are the Mies. But then again, if you don't wake somebody up at like fucking midnight to do something absolutely stupid, then are you truly living? Either way, we're gonna go ahead, check in on the Mies, and see what's going on. It'll be a real, it'll be a relatively short episode, just due to the fact that like the Mies are going to bed pretty quickly. So either way. It seems like ass titties want some new ass friends. What's up? N nothing much. I just want to die because I'm so tired, man. I heard that Uncle Ian <gasps> wants to be friends. Everybody wants to be friends with Uncle Ian. Great idea. I'll go scope things out. Sadly, Uncle Ian is fucking collapsed right now, but we can wake him up. Look at him go. Kind of looks like a nostalgia critic wearing those clothes. <laughs> but he's actually Uncle Ian. I never lose, ass titties. I never lose. Will they become friends? I, I, I guess they will. I guess they will. It went great! We're friends now. You know, you can never truly be friends with Ian because Ian is the best. Yeah. I want you to have this. He's not the coolest. That's somebody else, but, you know, hypnotizer. I hardly know her, though. <laughs> Fuck me, man. When you're too tired, you're gonna rely on puns. Oh, man, Uncle Ian is hanging out with ass titties. That's that's not good. Doromon, you need to wake your ass up and get rid of Ian. Ian's gonna fucking riz up your girl, man. It's gonna be so cringe. Also, I'm awake. It would make sense that he's awake since I'm awake. God damn, I'm tired as hell. How's it going? Going like shit, me, though you should know. I'm starving. You know what? I, I'm actually not starving. For once in my life, I'm not actually starving. Because I had, like, fucking food at work. Milk! Oh, thick and frothy. Served in a glass bottle straight from Granny's youth. You know, I smashed a bottle of milk on stream a couple days ago, so... You love milk bottle. I like chocolate milk better, but, you know... White milk, I guess it's good enough, I guess. No, chocolate milk. Shit's amazing. Let's see, what should we give to me? Huh. Mm, I don't know. Uh, probably more video games. I mean, we we're playing with a Nintendo 3DS XL, so, you know, we should give him that. We have one, therefore he should have one. Or it's more like I'm playing on a new Nintendo 3DS XL, not, not an old-ass one. Either way, you guys probably just heard, like, a Discord notification. He's on Discord! Look! He's on Discord on his Nintendo 3DS! What's he playing? Oh my god. I think he's playing Tomodachi Life. That sick bastard is playing the game. It's like fucking Inception. Is it like, am I playing a game that he is playing that is inside of the game that I am playing? What the fuck? Goddamn. Frozen, you're a, you're a strange man. You're a strange man. Either way, we go ahead... Get the money for the day. Ah, <laughs> uh, Chuckles, you you don't look right without your purple hair. Don't worry, I'll get some hairspray and call you purple. Purple! I love being purple! It's pretty much everything. Everything on my channel is purple. Doromon, fucking Chuckles. I don't know, there's a lot of purple on my channel. I don't really understand. Also, Doromon still looks like a small school child. It scares me. Yay, I got like 75 bucks. Is there any... I mean, I guess it's just, like, the shops are open, so therefore I should grab it before it turns over to the next day. I want a wig, star glasses, and a tiny flag. <laughs> we got red flags showing up everywhere, man. Red flags everywhere. Okay. Any new foods to grab? Bananas. Peanut butter jelly. Uh, that's not what a panini is, but... Okay. That's not what a panini... Or, actually, no, that is what a panini is. I'm thinking of a crepe. Okay. Roast beef. And then ink squid spaghetti. Nobody's gonna like that, but... 
You know, maybe Doromon will consume it. He is a dinosaur, so he'd eat just about anything I give him. What kind of cool clothes? I cannot buy that. No, no. Shirt dress. Oh, yeah. The wife beater. <laughs> Shirt dress. Oh, I like that. I like this one. Well, I guess... I don't know. This is like a fucking, like, it's Professor Oak or some shit like that. Um, I like this, like, one right here, but I guess we can't have it. I guess I'll just buy that. Have a nice day. It's not like I'm making any money at night where all the me's are asleep. Any new interiors that I can't buy? Still the fucking pumpkin patch. <laughs> you know it's bad when the rapid pumpkin appears. Mid-century modern? What does mid-century modern mean? Roman. You know, you know, it's just for all the gods to go into, like Ian. Man, the Mies don't really have much is going. They don't have much going on, do they? So go ahead and check in on the cafe. Nothing's going on. Yeah. Yeah, nothing much is going on. But we should probably add in a me. We should do a girl this time. Since now we have four guys and two girls, so you know. You just gotta you gotta make sure you gotta make sure you get them in. You know, I think I have the best idea since I was talking about the coolest today. We should probably add her in. Where the fuck is she? Where is... There she is! She's the coolest! Skip Bloom. Everybody loves Skip Bloom. If you want a tutorial on how to make a Skip Bloom, uh, here's a tutorial on how to make a Skip Bloom. I made it a girl. I mean, actually, it should be short as shit, because it's, like, really small. It should be fat as fuck. I mean, it is. Its entire body is just its head. Nah, I'll, I'll make it a little bit fat. Okay. What's its name? It's gonna be Skip Bloom. I don't know if they're gonna be able to say this correctly. But we'll see if it can say the word Skip Bloom. Skip Bloom. Then you gotta put the coolest. Or the cool. Ah, the coolest. The coolest. <laughs> but it's actually said the coolest. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> skip Bloom, the ghoul. And then just Skip Bloom. Uh, why did I pick that? I should just pick like the uh, release date of like Pokemon Silver. Pokemon. Pokemon, dude. I I'd fuck a Pokemon. <laughs> oh God. Let's see Pokemon Silver. There we go. When was that released? November twenty first, nineteen ninety nine. I mean. That's in America, but, you know, I am A-OK -okay with that. November 21st. That's coming up. It's coming up quick, Skip Bloom. It's 1999. Skip Bloom is older than me. Jesus, that's why it's so cool. Let's see. Not related to me. Skip Bloom. What would a Skip Bloom sound like? I'm Skip Bloom the coolest. <laughs> My nickname is Skip Bloom. Hmm. My birthday. I'm Skip Bloom the coolest. I'm skip I'm skip I'm skip The voice is killing me! I'm the coolest! Yeah, there you go. It works just so well. Well, for being the coolest, what should we say? I mean, this guy's gotta be cool. That's why she lives such a, such a slow and relaxed life. Hmm. I and mean, she's the coolest, so therefore she's very polite. I'm very flat. I'm very quirky. <laughs> so, be being cool results in being very slow, very polite, very flat, very relaxed, and very quirky. I mean, this is a Pokemon. Like, the Pokemon cannot talk. So it can't really be direct. And <laughs> Skip Loom is not the fastest Pokemon in the book. It also is one of the weakest Pokemon in the books, but that doesn't change the fact that it's the coolest. So, therefore, it's flat. And it's just... Look at its face. It's very quirky. I'd say this fits Skip Bloom to a T. Because she's just the coolest. Ah, she's easygoing and a buddy. Easygoing, overall, relaxed, open minded, and empathetic. Character does things at his or her own pace in a genuinely honest and kind manner. Manner. Why isn't there one that's just called the coolest? <laughs> I need to give her that. Nah, it'll be fine. Buddy, trustworthy and considerate, puts his or her friends first and works hard to make sure everyone's getting along with each other. Man, Skip Bloom just sounds like she's the coolest! <laughs> I think that's the goal. I think that was the goal. Ah, shit. They erected a space needle on my, on my island. 
these flowers. Good day to our excellent auditors. Welcome to the first daily edition of news. This will be a regular feature from now on. Chuckles, please stop talking. We'll be the first to inform you of the next great and greater Epsilon Island area. The Epsilon area? Today we'll bring you the latest news of morning at 9 and 7 o'clock. So don't miss it. Thanks for watching. <laughs> okay, thanks, Chuckles. Made to wake his ass up just to tell us. But yeah, we just unlocked the tower, and this pretty much just gives us really weird things. It gives us news reports, quote unquote, from the island, but. Well, I think you should just watch one to understand what they are. We got one coming in, Dorumon. You're watching me, news. Bargaining has always been a popular hobby, but some have taken it to a whole new level. Apparently, gardening in the ground or a window planter isn't enough. People are now potting on their roofs. Huh. They claim the roof is perfect for plants because it gets more sun. And veggies grow faster up there. Faster, eh? We asked some islanders for their thoughts on the matter. Amazing! I never thought I'd see the day! I can't believe something like that would happen. <laughs> Thanks for watching. You and me both. For your 11 o'clock me news, this is Darius Altarius. Signing off. You see, that's his full name. Legally full name. Yeah, they just, sometimes they're just gibberish, like random things going on the game thinks is funny. But yeah, there's a lot funnier ones later. Either way, we should check in on Skip Bloom. She looks like she's a little bit dead in the eyes. I'm Skip Bloom. There's nothing more important to me than my friends. And hurting my ears. <laughs> you know, you should get some fucking clothes, Claude. Dress in tights. Huh. Nothing really, like, green, though. You could be a gnome! Or a witch! The witch of Skip Bloom! Maybe that's why she's just so cool! Have this piece of shit that I found in a trash can. You're so slow! Calm the fuck down! I'm really, like, calm the fuck up more like it. She's a fucking witch, dude. <laughs> Skip Bloom's got magical powers that we just aren't aware of at this current time. We'll learn of it. We'll learn of it. Oh, Skip Bloom wants a friend? Alright. <laughs> who will she want to become his friend? It's gotta be Uncle Ian. What's happening? I have no clue. That's who you gotta tell me. I heard my Pokemon wants to be friends. Man, the connection between the Digimon and the Pokemon. Let's see if it let's see if it works. She might be annoyed by your voice, but then again, everybody's voices are a bit unfortunate in this game. Just fucking hopping around at fucking 11, 11 a.m. Or p.m. Whatever. Wow, the friendship. It went great. I'll go grab my stuff! Friends, no! <laughs> friends, no! You know, I don't want to be your friend right now. Yeah, I want you to have this. Please give me hairspray. It's a fucking fan, okay. I'm like, okay. Very good. Thank you for the fan. God, my fucking ear itches. Okay, well, now I think we have enough money to buy that. Oh, we don't. Aw. Big sad. Frozen is big sad he can't buy women's clothing. He dressed in women's clothing and hang around in bars. <laughs> God damn. Dude, Knuckles, you can express your gender norms in any single way. All I care is that Knuckles is here. Hmm. Should we make any songs? Do we have anybody? Let's see, Ass Titties has an opera song. Huh. Interdasting. Okay, give me a second. I'm going to make something stupid. Okay, get ready. I will eat this cat, starring ass titties. She looks so serious. I like to 
to consume cats. They taste like dick. My lover's cock is furry just like a cat, so I ate it too. My cat has no dip, now I have to. He sent me to ER. I need more cat dip. I will eat this cat and die. Perfect. <laughs> I eat cat dick. <laughs> now that was a good song. <laughs> that was great. Anyway, uh, I don't think anybody else has got any more problems and everybody's just like gone to bed. So I guess as always, we're going to have to end the episode here, even though because somebody's at the park. I guess it's just ass titties running away from the police after she told everybody she eats cat dick. I don't know what's going on there. But either way, we're going to have to end this episode here. So, next time on Tomodachi Life, I guess we're going to have to see what more is going on. Also, Uncle Ian's back there. And before I end this episode, I want to thank all of my YouTube members, including... The Disciples of Epsilon, Valric, Amber, and Fenix. The Epsilon Sage... Spirit Rosewolf. Without you all, this channel wouldn't stay afloat. So thank you for all your support, and I'll see you guys next time!